Welcome back to the Lockout Men Podcast Show. Thank you, thank you. I appreciate you guys being here. If you guys like what I do over here, don't forget to hit that like, subscribe, and all those other buttons that show support for the channel. We breaking truckers over here. That's what's up. That's what this segment is all about of the Lockout Men Podcast Show. Breaking truckers. Yes, sir. And today's trucker that we're going to be breaking is Trucking Beauty. Her TikTok is beyond the grind, but she also has a Instagram page that you guys could check out too, up under Trucking Beauties, all right? In this particular video right here, she says, go and get your CDLs in 2022. Now, look, let me let me just ease back a little bit. Now, I'm, I'm not here to suggest that you get your CDLs or even tell you to go and get your CDLs because a lot of people like to like to encourage people like this young lady here but i just want to just say you know trucking is not for everybody her situation is not going to be your situation the reason why she got her cdls is not going to be your reason for getting your cdls okay now don't get me wrong i mean getting your cdls and getting into a truck will particularly change your life period okay but again what was good for her and how she started and why she got her cdls isn't going to correlate to you getting your cdl so you really got to take the time and really and truly and mentally figure that is getting the cdls right for me now if you're in a if you're in a no risen job if that makes any sense then looking at somebody that's driving a truck making thousands of dollars a week that might be something for you to even consider okay but but you got to realize there's a lot of sacrifices before you even get into this truck you got to realize you're not going to be with your family. You got to realize that you're going to be over the road a lot. You got to realize that your time is going to be different. You're going to be sharing. You're going to be sharing public showers. You're going to you. You're not going to get your sleep in. Your food is going to be different. Your your health is going to take a hit. You know what I'm saying? There's a lot of things that you really, really and truly got to think about before you decide to spend the extra money because this is something else people is not telling you about either cdls can cost up an excessive of 10k some as low as 6k and the mid-tier is like right in the middle but there's ways that you can get your cdls that won't even have to affect the pockets you can get you can go by getting your cdl by a grant maybe use a credit card or maybe jump on to one of these company sponsors uh schools okay but that's enough about that listen it, it this is not about me it's about me breaking truckers okay so enough of what i got what i got to say about getting your cdls let's see what trucking beauty has to say about getting the cdls hold on What's up, y'all? I just want to hop on here before the year is over with to encourage somebody to go get your CDL. You've been thinking about it. It's year 2022, go get your CDL. It'll change your life. It'll put you, you and your family in a better position. It put me in a better position. And the time frame of going to school and just learning, like, it's very hard to transition from going to school and still having to maintain, you know, job, your job and work and everything, your everyday life. For me, I knew this was something that I wanted to do. You know, I made a huge sacrifice. I took, had my hours being cut. 
barely not getting any hours and still I was so in the bind. I never in my life been so fucked up around that time I was getting my CDL. Going to school and still working and still maintaining bills and kids like but I knew like I ain't gonna never be in this position again. This is really gonna get me where I need to be. And it did, you know, it did. Within a year of driving, I got my own company. I got my own trucks. I just wanna encourage somebody, year 2022, go get your CDL. You ain't gonna regret it. I went from making like five to $700 a week working to making 15 to 2,000 a week, a week. More than that, if you get with the right company, that right there, I can't even imagine getting paid $500 a week. Mm -mm. Go get your CDL. You'll thank me later. If you got any questions, I'm more than open to help you out and let you know the resources that I use or that I know about it. 2022 go get your cds all right that's it that's it 2022 she says go and get her cdls you heard her story you heard where she came from and you see the reason why she chose to get the cdls is it for you though let me know in the comments below if it's for you if it works for you do you feel are you in the same situation as trucking beauty was in maybe that getting your CDL would change your life. But again, like I said, you know, really put some thought into it. That's going to do it for this segment of breaking truckers on the lockout man podcast show. Make sure you guys go and follow beyond the grind on TikTok and Instagram. She do have some good content over there. Not only that she's a truck driver, but she's a dispatcher too. So if you guys have trucks that needs to get rolling, maybe you guys could give her a call and see what she can do for you. Also, on the flip side of that, Trucking Beauty. This is an invitation for you to come on the Lockout Man podcast show and share your experience with us. I would appreciate that you reach out to me. I would love to hear your story. Okay, guys, who do you want me to break next? Who do you want me to break next? Let me know in the comments below or email me at lockoutmanpodcast at gmail.com. Stay tuned for the next Lockout Man podcast to see who we break next. Feel there's something in the air tonight Got a feeling coming over me I swear that this is that place to be In the water, in the, the water, in the water